Hello, today I will show you how to create a simple 3D effect. So we'll see how to go from this to something like this. All right, fantastic. So let's get to it. Okay, so open your Adobe Photoshop and you know, just drag the image that you want to to make uh, the effect on it and uh, first of all uh, we'll alt click to this one so we'll unlock it and now uh, we'll make we'll desaturate it so you can just go to image adjustment desaturate it in here or we can just click shift control u and now we will duplicate it by pressing ctrl g and let's call, let's call this one here red and we'll just double click on it so we will open the layer style dialog and now uh, we'll uncheck the green channels in here and also the blue channel and we we'll press ok and that will give us this red uh, channel here and make sure to uh, and check this one in here now we will duplicate the red one by pressing ctrl g and we we'll call this cyan again we we'll double click so we can load the, the, the lifestyle dialog now we we'll uncheck the red one and we'll check the green and the blue channels and we press ok as you can see it's a, a cyan channel now we will go to the red in here and we press Ctrl T and we try to make it uh, into the right like this little bit and press enter and we go to the sign one in here and we press Ctrl T again and we make it left and we press enter now we check this uh, the original uh, black and white picture and as you can see the, the left uh, red and the right sign will disappear now uh, I did uh, apply uh, another texture into the image uh, it's a scratch text and I will just drag it and apply it in here I will put this uh, content I'm using in uh, a folder you can download in the link in the description below now uh, I will make it bigger something like that now uh, I, will up, I will go to the blending mode option and I will choose linear dodge add in here and I will make the opacity 50% now I will duplicate it and I will press ctrl T and I will rotate it and try to make it bigger again press enter and now uh, it look a little bit cooler I think now what we're gonna do is apply a vignette so it's like the easiest thing to do so we just go to the reading in here and you choose uh, radio and reverse it and now we'll change the color we'll make this one this white color in here into black press ok and also this one in here into black and press ok now we'll try to adjust a little bit uh, the areas that we want to apply the black like so a little bit and we'll press ok now we we'll try to adjust the angle I'm gonna choose 30 for the angle and for the scale we we'll try to adjust it for whatever we want so we just choose 150 scale percent and we we'll press ok now we we'll change the blending mode to soft light and there you have we have a cool vignette as you can see and that's it 
so uh, I hope that you enjoyed this tutorial and it was a little bit helpful for you don't forget to subscribe and comment and you know, have a nice day thank you for watching